Hello dear viewers, I am Khan Bahadur, Assistant Professor of Statistics and you are watching my YouTube channel Statistics by Khan. Dear viewers, I have also a Facebook page and group with the same name Statistics by Khan for basic statistics. So please if you want to learn statistics then join the page and the group and also follow my YouTube channel Statistics by Khan. Dear viewers, today I am making a video on the demand of one of the followers of my Facebook page and group and a YouTube channel Statistics by Khan. The person asks about the difference between an estimator and a statistic. What the basic difference between an estimator and a statistic is. So let's start the video. First of all, let's know about the parameter. What the parameter is. Okay, parameter. Parameter is the characteristic of a population. Uh, for example, if we calculate the arithmetic mean from the entire population, then the uh, general name for this uh, arithmetic mean is parameter and the specific name is the uh, population mean. Uh, so, for example, if we are calculating the population mean, so we will denote it by mu and the formula for this will become summation. I taking value from 1 to n if there are n observations and xi divided by the capital N. So by this formula we can find the population mean. The general name for this is a parameter and the specific name is the arithmetic mean from the population. The parameter, the characteristic of a population uh, is called parameter. So. Uh, this is the arithmetic mean. The general name is parameter because it has been calculated from the entire population. All the observations that are in the population are included in the calculation of the arithmetic mean. So such quantities which have been calculated from the entire population in which all the units, all the measurements from the units are being involved. So they are called uh, parameter. Uh, similarly, uh, instead of all the values, if we select uh, some of them, that is uh, technically called sample, if we select uh, a sample and then calculate the same arithmetic mean, we uh, select a sample and then calculate uh, the arithmetic mean from that sample. So that will become, uh, notation will be x bar, usually we are denoting it by x bar and this will be again I is equal to from 1 to the small n and this will be xi and again this will be divided by small n. Uh, the algebraic differences are there if you are denoting uh, a parameter so the population size this n is called the population size it will be capital uh, and uh, this uh, will be uh, a Greek letter while this will be Latin uh, word or letter and this will be small this population size and this is sample size so uh, this will be called estimator this will be called the estimator and this is a parameter what does this estimator do actually this estimator estimates this value instead of Calculating this measurement from all the units of the population We are going to select some of the units from the population and then we are calculating uh, uh, The arithmetic mean from the sample and this measurement uh, is called the estimator uh, So there is a bit confusion in estimator in another word that is estimate So there is a bit confusion, but let me explain you this estimate. So this formula, this algebraic expression, this formula or this algebraic expression is called estimator. And if you get the numerical value, after plugging the numerical values, summing and dividing by the number of observations, you will get a single value. So then this single value, this is denoted by x bar. Uh, it will represent, it will describe a numerical value. This will represent 
this formula. This will represent a numerical value. So then this is called an estimate. Uh, if you have uh, studied the statistics books of Shia Muhammad Choudhury, so uh, in the uh, initial chapters, he differentiated between the estimator and the estimate. He uh, emphasizing that estimator is this algebraic expression, while estimate is this numerical value. For example, I'm taking the numerical value as 95. Let's say uh, I have added all the observations and divided those uh, uh, that total by the number of observations, and I got 95. So now this 95 is an estimate, and this algebraic expression is estimator. But I have seen in, in many uh, other books, there is no difference between estimate and estimate. They are using them interchangeably. Rather, they are using this word, estimate. You will see this word very rarely in the other books. So there is no difference in many of the books between estimator and estimate. But if you have to differentiate, so estimator is the algebraic expression, this formula. This formula is called estimator, while this numerical value is called uh, estimate. Estimator may be represented by this capital X and a bar, while estimate will be represented by the small x and bar. So uh, this is estimator and this is uh, estimate. Now, uh, we have also, we are going to Usually we define statistic as a numerical value that has been calculated from um, the sample data. So this numerical value is also called statistic. Without this. Because it's a single value and any value that has been calculated from the sample is called statistic without S. If uh, we have more values, if we have more than one value, so then you can attach S with it, so it will become statistics. But in that case, there will be, for example, more means x1 bar, x2 bar, first means, second means, third means. So in that case, you can attach S, then that will become statistics. Uh, that will be that will become plural. Okay. Uh, again, uh, usually we are going to define statistics as. Uh, the numerical values calculated from the sample are a single statistic, a numerical value calculated from a single sample. Uh, you know, in the beginning, we are defining statistics like this, but uh, uh, again, I'm emphasizing if we move toward uh, sufficient statistics or efficient statistics or complete statistics. So, there you can see in that case, uh, we are referring to this. Algebraic expression rather than this numerical value. Sufficient statistics, complete statistics, efficient statistics. So in that case, remember this, that in that case we don't mean this numerical value. Rather we mean this algebraic expression. So again, there is confusion uh, if you ask uh, the uh, students uh, what is the statistics. And if he knows this interpretation of statistics, so he will definitely uh, explain that any numerical value that has been calculated from the sample data. Numerical value calculated from the sample data is called a uh, statistic. But uh, when we are going to um, uh, discuss completeness or sufficiency, efficiency, speci uh, specifically in uh, these scenarios, we are attaching uh, the word statistic rather than estimator. We, we usually don't say that uh, sufficient estimator or complete estimator are uh, uh, like that, but rather we say sufficient statistics, complete statistics, or efficient statistics, uh, statistic. So uh, in that case, again, we are referring uh, statistics to this uh, uh, algebraic expression rather than that numerical value. So there is a, there is a, um, a bit uh, uh, difference, and there is some similarity as well. So. Don't get confused in these uh, differences whether this is estimate or this is estimate and this is statistic and this is statistic. So uh, don't get confused in these uh, minor things. Uh, they are, can be used interchangeably, but these are the explanations. They are usually we say 
antinumerical value that has been calculated from the sample data is called statistics. But if we focus, sometimes we yeah, ignore this uh, this explanation or this definition uh, of sufficient statistic or complete statistics. So uh, if we ignore this, so it becomes very well. But uh, if we wholly solely say that no, the numerical value is statistics, so then uh, what about complete statistics? What about sufficient statistics? What about efficient statistics? So uh, uh, there is confusion. So um, my uh, point is that don't get confused in these minor differences whether this is estimate or and many books they are using estimate for this as well. They are, don't differentiate between estimate and estimate, they are using them interchangeably in the same way as statistics. So, if you have to differentiate by any means, so this is estimator and this is statistics. And in that context, this estimate equals to a statistic. So, the numerical values, you can say the numerical value is an estimate or statistic. Uh, in the same way, uh, this expression, this algebraic expression, if this is the arithmetic means, you can say estimator. Uh, this is the arithmetic mean. Its specific name, its general name is parameter. Why? Because it has been calculated from the entire population. Its uh, specific name is sample arithmetic mean, and the general name is estimator because it has been calculated from the subset of the population. So this is called estimator. Uh, for example, another parameter we can take as the uh, population uh, standard deviation. The population standard deviation will become uh, this is the notation for the standard population standard deviation and this will be sigma uh, i taking value from 1 to n xi minus mu whole square divided by n in this rule. So this again parameter. Its specific name is population standard deviation while its uh, general name is again parameter because in this calculation because in this calculation we have considered uh, we have taken measurements from all the units of the population so its specific name is uh, population standard deviation while its general name is parameter so i want to focus i, I want to explain you what actually parameter is parameter is any characteristic of the population. It means if you have calculated any measurement, uh, any numerical value, and you have taken all the measurements uh, from all the years of the population, so then the, the same measure will be called as parameter. It will be its, uh, uh, its common name, and its specific name may be, uh, for example, its standard deviation, and this is population mean. So, this parameter, what would be the estimator of this? So in this case, the estimator would be, uh, it will be denoted by S, and what are the differences? Notational differences are there. Uh, I taking value from 1 to small n, xi minus, this will be replaced by x bar. This is the population mean, while this is the sample mean, and divided by small n, and under the root. So this is again estimator. This is again estimator. Why? Because this estimates this. If you don't have uh, all the units of the population, so you can't calculate this, you can't compute this. But if you have some of the uh, units from the population, so you can calculate this. So this is sample standard deviation. So a specific name is sample standard deviation. And general name is estimator. A specific name is population standard deviation, and general name is parameter. So these are parameters because this quantity and this quantity, both of them have been calculated from all the measurements taken from the units of all the uh, from all the units of the population. While this is statistic, or this is estimator, this is estimator. Why? It's because uh, these have been calculated from some of the units of the population. So, uh, these are estimators, these are statistics, while these are parameters. So, uh, these are the 
uh, differences, and I focus upon this. Hope this will clear your concept. Thank you so much. If you are having any other problems, you can mention. I will try to make value and explain the things in detail. Thank you so much.